senior head instructor. Bow to first degree, apprentice instructor, advanced, and intermediate. All right. 100 jumping jacks. Yes, sir. sir. Begin. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one. 
Second set. Yes, sir. sir. Begin. One, One sir. Two, two sir. Three, sir. Four, sir. Five, sir. Six, sir. Seven, sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Seven, sir. Eleven, sir. Twelve, sir. Thirteen, sir. Fourteen, sir. Fifteen, sir. Sixteen, sir. Seventeen, sir. Eighteen, sir. Nineteen, sir. Twenty, sir. One, sir. Two, sir. Three, sir. Four, sir. Five, sir. Six, sir. Seven, sir.
back to center, seated ankle. Center. Center. Yes, sir. Fist is asleep. Fist is asleep. 
Forward and tuck. Forward and tuck. Forward and tuck. Forward and tuck.
you know, switch corners, do something. Make sure you're not in the same spot. All right, very good. That's it, just stand. It's yes, sir. Sir. Stand tall. Yes, yes sir. sir. Over salt a little bit. Sorry, how we were doing the cross. Separate your feet. Okay, now cross. One. Lifting up, falling forward, kind of comfortably. And now spin. Boom. Of course. Nice balance, right? Does that make sense? Yes, yes sir. sir. Stay balanced the whole time. What you don't want is this. And you'll be able to tell the difference. What you don't want is this. Right? Because you have no control over that step. If I said, if I went like this and I said freeze, and you went, whoa. You're going to fall into that. So it has to be one, freeze. Two, three. Does that make sense? Yes, yes sir. Have control of the body the whole time. All right, now, come step off for a second, and let's run it again. Yes, sir. That's it. Stand. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Sorry, I'm just going to You can turn right this way. You can turn right this way. Look, like everybody wants to look at themselves. Everybody says it too. I see it. I see it. It was like, hmm. <laughs> Five round salute. Five round salute. Two tires under trail. Two tires under trail. From return. Hard and soft. Crane walking. Hard and soft. Try it, try it. Crane walking. Nice. You set? Set. Now, when you do it this time, a lot of times when you do it in a group, I want to change your mindset. When you do it in a group, you want to move. Yes, you should generally try to move together, but I want you to focus on your body and less about moving at the same time, yes? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So take the time and really, just give yourself time to do the motion. All right, here you go. Yes, sir. Let's go for a turn. Hard and soft, crane walking, go. Hard and soft, soft. crane walking. Crane walking. Crane walking. Sitting arm, hand, and waist. Sitting arm, hand, and waist. One finger asks the question. One finger asks the question. Crane wing punching. Crane wing punching. punching. Yes. Fist to the sleeve. Fist to the sleeve. Mm -hmm. Hard and soft. Hard and soft. Crane walking. Crane walking. Descending arm, hand, and waist. Descending arm, hand, and waist. One finger asks the question. One, One finger asks the question. question. Crane wing punching. Crane wing punching. Fist to the sleeve. Fist to the sleeve. Five ounce salute. Five ounce salute. Very good. All right. Now take a quick break, and when we come back, we're going to go over one or two more things in that section of motions, and then we're going to do an application, of course, on pads. Yes, sir. We haven't each other quite yet. There are no crawling. Crane, 
one. There's two applications to this one. The second one we can't do, but it has to do with wrapping and trapping the hand and getting trying to get into an arm bar position, or really just controlling that arm. Uh, essentially, if I could do it without touching it, so open arm really, really big like this, and then go like this. So I'd be hooking this arm and then wrapping up, pulling pulling that and catching an arm bar. Mm -hmm. Real fun. This is real fun. So you kind of front. Well, because if he's throwing, like if he's, right. if we're tussling and I can pull this down, then I'm going to hook that arm, grab it, and then rotate down that way. And the uh, other, yeah. I'm not going to deal with it. Yeah, that. So there's that one. But when we come here, we're, we focused on the strike last class. You want to make sure this is coming past your ear, just right here past your ear. Right? For form's sake and for the sake of application, it has to come past your ear. Yes, that makes sense. Make sure you're twisting the hips for the strike. So at the end of the stance, you should be in a full bow stance, hips turn, rotating here. Yeah, yeah, because you did. Now that's just for the exercise. In practicality, you won't jump into a full bow stance that strikes the body in the ribs, right? You're going to slip how much you need to and strike where, when you can. This is just a strength exercise. So there's a reason we do it the way we do it. Yes, sir. And it looks nice when you perform. Okay. Any questions? Or what I just did. Okay, then let me continue. So, presenting one finger. We, anytime you're blocking, especially after a strike, you should bring the hand in. Am I right or am I wrong? Right? You're blocking your face, so why would I try to block out here? Right? So, it has less power. So, after I've struck, then I'm going to trade the hands, right? So, one is going to come in, chest, and then I'm going to block again and dip. Right? So, I'm slipping the punch one more time. Stepping back with the left. So I can correct the hips, sink into a horse, and I'm going to thrust, boom, come out diagonally. Outside block, make sure that you simulate that, but essentially you're blocking and grabbing. As you shift, you're going to bring this right to the hip, right? Because it's already lined up, you got it out straight, you're going to pull it in, and boom, there's your power, we went over that as well. Hard and soft. Crane will right, so boom, boom. We do it slow in the form, right? This, because you just did all this fast stuff, it's okay to slow down, boom, strike, come out dynamic, real strong, and then chamber again. Cross, cross, core. So if you notice, we did two hands on the first time and one hand on the second time. Does that make sense? Yes, sir. Descending arm hand weight, same thing, make sure this hand comes back past your hand, past your head, strike out, pull in, and separate. So if you see, don't come here like this. Don't only bend the weight, and then don't only bend the legs. You have to do both if you're going to duck that last one for one finger. Ask the question. Step back, see, and correct, and strike. And now we're going to go outside block, strike, off the hip again, boom. Speak together. Yes, sir. Now, so before we move on in the form, I want y'all to get into a group. You're going to practice that. And then we're going to uh, do our application. So, Jacqueline and Ms. Frank, y'all are going to practice here with each other. Mr. Hogan, Mr. Nelson, and Saul, y'all are going to practice here in the middle. Mr. Willow, Gillian, and Sophie, y'all are going to practice here. Okay. All right. So, Mr. Hogan, can you lead it first? Uh, take your time to emphasize the things. And I give y'all an opportunity to take y'all time to emphasize the things as well. The same focus, Saul. Give us the end of late. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Sending arm and sending arm and waist. One finger asks a question. One finger asks a question. Crane wing punch. This is sweet. Hard and soft. Hard and soft. Crane walking. Crane walking. Sending arm and One finger asks a question. One finger asks a question. Crane wing punch. Punching. This is This is sweet. Hot yeah. animal salute. Hot yeah. animal salute. Two tigers. 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 Two 
Five animals to lose. Sending our pen and waste. One point you ask the question. So if he's here, I'm gonna I'm gonna sacrifice the first one, right? 
I'm gonna, I'm, that's gonna hurt, that's enough. That's enough, right? So boom, fight started, and you come out with that one. And it's just naturally the way the shoulder wants to go. It's just like a, uh, what's the, uh, you know, the- Where your belt flies. Those, thank you. So, so I'm here, right? and then I just engage those muscles because look, my body also turns. So now my shoulders are this way. That means the open belt fly, right, is this, there, it's natural. Off the back this. So interest, boom, coming out, boom. Let the body shift as you go. And then by that time, y'all can start testing if that's what y'all are gonna do. All right, Mr. Hogan, I'd like you to be Mr. Nelson partner. Yes, sir. sir. So make contact, it doesn't have to be super hard, but once it touches, really, that's the reflex. As soon as the elbow touches, come back with that back fist. Sir. Willow, be Jillian's partner, Miss Frank. Be Jackson's partner. Jaw and you're close and you have to generate power. Me being little, 
<coughs> this is my specialty. <laughs> I used to do bodybuilding. There's a lot of lunch too. Okay, so here, so he, he's closed, he's in my space, his breast stinks. Boom, that's one. <laughs> when, I come, when I come to that second one, I'm doing less this, and I'm just kind of correcting where I came from. So his, I hit here, and I'm coming down, right? Boom. Because all I want to hit him with is the knuckles. Most of the ones. So you're not really getting out there. It's like pretty tight. Yeah, man. it's pretty tight. Because the best thing, for my shoulder, it's like the joint. I want to be right. efficient and I don't want to hurt myself. Right. I'm likely to hurt myself the further away my hand is from my body. Right. And so I don't want any injuries. Like I said, just saying I'm little, right? So one, boom, two, mm. Mm. And a lot of it's in the waist. So I get power, I can turn my waist and I'm not moving very much. Right, crowded. Mm. Mm. So at least you get the first two. You get to jump off, right? Oh, get out of my face. Yeah, so, and then, now what, Now let's look in the mirror and watch the angle. So one, jaw, and now when you're coming back to the jaw, you just have, notice your arm is already where it needs to be. Correct the elbow, like, because you want to bring it back, and then come across. Right, elbow, boom, and then right back. Yeah. Yes. And the closer you can get your elbow to the hip, the better, because we're going to elbow, the turning of the waist will give us our angles. Now start pivoting, pivot, pivot. So you're striking pivot. like here. Exactly. Chin. So it doesn't matter what your arm's doing over here. Exactly. Yeah. Chin, bow. Exactly. That makes sense. So that other stuff is stylistic. You see what, it's good to see, you get a pad, you see what yeah, parts of it are. Nice. I didn't realize, I thought it was like way out of here, like with the- Oh, like this? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so, okay. Yes, 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 power. All places. Good stuff. Uh, was there a handle on? I feel like there was something else I wanted to show you all. So small, small. Ah, oh, so the other application, the other application is, say they are very close at this point, grappling type stuff, right? Sometimes the natural stuff comes out. I'm gonna tell you kung fu. We're not a one at the ground stuff, but if you got me pinned up against something, I can do something with. If I got my back again, I can do something about it, right? So he's got me wrapped up a little bit. I'm gonna come up with my elbow to get his face just off me, right? So even if I'm here and he's got my arms pinned, I can push up and pull out like this, right? So I'm here, he's here, and then I come out and I can step around putting pressure on his neck. But I put that away from me, right? So I get him away from me. So if he's on me, coming up, pressing out with that elbow, because that's an easy group, muscle group to engage, and then come sliding that out, getting my palm on his chin, and then pushing away from his chin. Right, pushing into his chin and then trying to move around him, right? Just get my angle and get my control back. Yeah, exactly. This would be a lot easier if I could touch. But it's full on. Don't get him off. Take your off. All right, massive man. Let's grab our stab.